Hi, I'm Jacob and this is Sam and we're from Science for Kids. Thanks for joining us today. Today we're looking at elastic potential energy. <laughs> A bit of elastic potential energy stored in here and Sam's gonna release the energy. Push. Oh, no, Sam, are oh, you going crazy, mate? <laughs> oh no, let's shoot the balloon off. There's elastic potential energy stored in here. And when we release the pressure, it's changed into kinetic energy. I'm gonna keep doing it. Oh, At yeah. the camera! Wow! <laughs> 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 oh. <Whoa. laughs> Do you know what this is? Yep. You don't know what this is? Mm -mm. I'm gonna pull this back. Like that. And then I'm gonna bring this around and connect it up to there. If I put. <laughs> A piece of cheese there. If I oh, I know, mouse trap. A mouse trap. Do you want to pretend to be the mouse? <laughs> do, oh, no. No, no. no, don't do that. There's too much elastic potential energy <laughs> stored. Maybe if this is the mouse. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. So you bring it where the cheese is. Are you ready? <laughs> ready? <laughs> oh! <laughs> it's caught the mouse, hasn't it, Sam? Yeah. Hey. The word potential. Ha. Huh, means stored. What about this one? Oh. What's this thing called? Oh. Rubber band. A rubber band? What's another name for it? Some people call it an elastic band. An elastic band because it stores elastic potential energy. When you wind this clockwork spring up, you're actually storing elastic potential energy, which later on gets changed into kinetic energy, which is the energy of movement. Oh, look. Oh, it can turn! It can turn! <laughs> oh, oh no, the boat sunk! <laughs> this spring actually has elastic potential energy when you pull it apart. What about this spring, Sam? Whoa! Look at this! Whoa! Look at all the elastic potential energy there! Whoa! Look at that! You know what? When you compress the air, it pushes together like a spring, and then when the pressure's high enough, it pushes the rocket out. Do you think there might be any energy stored in here, Sam? Yes. What sort? Air. Air's not energy. I don't know. Elastic potential energy. Do you feel the elasticity? Let's see if we can change it to another form of energy. What will happen if you get something sharp, Sam? What? It'll pull. Elastic potential energy in the balloon was turned into sound energy, wasn't it, Sam? Yeah. Ah, yes. Yeah. I'm giving this balloon some elastic potential energy. This time we're not going to turn it into sound energy. We're going to turn it into kinetic energy. How are we going to turn it into kinetic energy, Sam? How are we going to make this elastic potential energy change into movement energy? How? That's it! We let go of the balloon! Oh! Elastic potential energy into kinetic energy. Sam, I've got this little rocket now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get a tablet. An Alka-Seltzer tablet. Can I help? Yep. And what do I do? What do you do? You're going yeah. to... Yeah? Put a quarter of it yeah. into the rocket ship. Okay. Then you're going to squeeze up. Oh, that's not nah, just a quarter. Then you're going to squeeze some water up into the pipette. And then you're going to squeeze the water into the rocket. Big squeeze. That's it. Then I'm going to put the end on. Put it there like that. Oh, what do you think might happen, Sam? Whoa! <laughs> How good was that? As the air pressure built up inside that rocket tube, the, oh, that look. Ooh, the pressure got more and more, Daddy. the elasticity got stronger and stronger, oh, Daddy, and nothing. finally it pushed, it Daddy, pushed out the running. rocket, and it pushed the rocket up into the sky. Daddy. When I stretch the spring and let go, the dinosaur head jumps open. See that? Jumps open. There's stored elastic Daddy, potential energy there. Again. Oh, okay. Oh, what a mess here we've got, Sam. Yay, it's a party. It's a party, eh? Yeah. Uh, okay, so you need a bit of that tablet. This tablet? Yeah. And you need to squeeze some water in. Water? 
That's it, Mr. Squeezy. That's it. Then you need to put the end on. Jam the end on. Push on hard. Push it on hard and quickly. And then turn it upside down and put it on the table. Uh oh! Oh no! It could shoot the toilet for it! Thanks so much for joining us on Science for Kids. Hope you've learned a little bit more about energy. And we'll see you next time.